Hey, fatty, what does a typical day of eating look like for me on the sugar diet? Okay, I'm going to keep pounding this in your head. It's simple. You're running on small boluses of pure sugar through the day, and then at night you have a main meal. It's a low-fat diet. Through the day, zero fat, just sugar. No protein, just sugar. Okay, this is my cutting protocol. Once you're lean, you can play. It's just a low-fat diet. Once you're lean, do whatever you want. Just stick to the low-fat diet. Fat's making you fat, you idiot. So I'll get up in the morning and I'll start the day off with a glass of super snake juice. Which is snake juice, electrolyte, salts, as normal. Okay, if you're going to use the packets. Okay, it's the same packets. You're just adding sugar to the water. Table sugar, that's it. It's just sugar. You're not going to die, fatty. You're going to cut weight like crazy. This will pump some serious electrolytes into my cells right in the morning. Okay, that sugar will drive the salt into your cells. Okay, your body will hold on to that electrolyte. So I'll get up, have a glass of super snake juice. Carry on. Okay, then maybe an hour, two hours, three hours, four hours later, I'll have another shot of sugar. Maybe I'll have some fruit. Maybe I'll have some pure liquid sugar. Honey, blackstrap molasses. Okay, maybe I'll have some candy. Okay, if it's a pre-workout, I might even have some Sour Patch Kids or some straight candy. Okay, there's a million sources of sugar. It's sugar. Rev the metabolism up to the moon. More fat loss. Crazy energy for the amount of calories you're taking in. Okay, you're hardly eating anything. Okay, I love when people say, oh, you're addicted to sugar. If I'm not addicted, why am I only eating 200 calories or 300 calories in a sitting? And then going for hours after. That's the beauty of it. The bang for your buck as far as energy. Per calorie for sugar kicks the shit out of protein and fat by a mile. Plus fat's nine calories a gram, you idiot. Okay, if you went and took two tablespoons of pure oil, that's like 240 calories. You know how much energy you'll have from that? None. Okay, try taking in a couple hundred calories of strawberry jam. Okay, I'm just taking in small sugar boluses through the day. Three, maybe four, maybe you would have two. I don't miss breakfast. Okay, I'm revving myself up right in the morning. I'm not doing any intermittent fasting. If you want to do a longer fast, 48 or 72 hours or longer, okay, on normal snake juice, go ahead. It's fine. Okay, you can do it on super snake juice. Lose weight. The skinniest people live the longest. High energy. Sugar gives you energy. So a little sugar doses throughout the day. I might have another shot of super snake juice later in the day. Get a little more salt in. Okay, drive a little more electrolyte into my cells. Depends how much I sweat and how much cardio I do. Okay, if you're just a fat pig sitting on your ass, you're going to lose weight like crazy microdosing sugar like this. Just pick your sugar source. Okay, obviously, just using fruit is perfect if you're a super fat pig. Okay, but you can have whatever you want. You're not trying to get full during the day. You're trying to have crazy energy and feel slim. Cut up. Flat stomach. It's perfect. When your body's running this hot, you burn body fat like it's going out of style. Insane weight loss. Okay, I'm losing weight way too fast right now. Now that this dialed in this good. At night, the main meal. Lean meat. Lean meat, you fat pigs. A pile of vegetables, you fat pigs. That's the most important one, the volume from the vegetables. Fruit, starch. I'd recommend if you're a super fat pig, bring the starch down. Crank the vegetables through the roof. Okay, crank the fruit up. Wet fruit. You're not going to get fatty watermelon fatty. Speaking of watermelon, exactly what I'm having for dinner. I'll probably have like half of this watermelon with my lean meat for dinner with a bunch of peas and carrots. That's my dinner. Okay, how awesome is that? How awesome is that? Zero carb dieting blows. Blows. Ass draggers. Hormone problems. Shady sleep. You gotta rely on caffeine. It's laughable.
that's laughable. That's what my day looks like. Okay, lean meat, vegetables, fruit, starch. Play with it. Through the day, you're going to lose weight like crazy. You weigh yourself before your main meal. If you're listening to me and you're hitting those little boluses of sugar, two, three, maybe four of those in the day, maybe 150, 200 calories, go by how you feel, you're going to be lighter at night than you are in the morning when you wake up. Because you're still eating your main meal later in the day. I'll eat around 5 o'clock, go to bed at like 8.39. Okay, I go to bed early. Okay, since I started doing this diet, I'm getting up crazy early and going to bed early. It strains your sleep schedule right out. There's no stress. It's not like a zero-carb carnivore diet where your cortisol's cranked through the roof 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. Pure sugar. No added fat is the king of weight loss. The king of adherence. Adherence. King of energy. The king. Until next time, cut the fat.